Hey everyone, welcome to AutoPH. Today, we'll be checking out this 2019 Mitsubishi Expander GLX Plus. This is gonna be a full tour and review of the Expander. We'll be showing the different exterior and interior features. But before we begin, we'd like to thank our friends at Le Mans Stellar Motor Corporation Mitsubishi Angeles for letting us feature this vehicle. You can find their contact details in the description of this video. Let's go ahead and check it out. The Expander is a compact 7-seater multi-purpose vehicle manufactured by Mitsubishi. It was launched in the Philippines in March 2018 and is imported from Indonesia. It is sold as the Nissan Livina in other markets. In the Philippines, it competes with the likes of Honda BRV and Mobilio, Toyota Rush and Avanza, and the Suzuki Ertiga. This 2019 Mitsubishi Expander GLX Plus has an MSRP of 1,075,000 Philippine Pesos. The front end of the Expander is known for its striking looks and is quite controversial. The Expander gets split headlights which is quite a trend today. You have slim LED parking lights on top and multi-reflector halogen headlights below. GLX Plus and above variants get halogen fog lights on the lower portion of the bumper. The Expander's front fascia is flanked by Mitsubishi's dynamic shield grille finish in piano black. We personally think this finish is better than the chrome on higher variants. Overall, the front end of the Expander is very sharp looking and to us, is the most unique looking in its class. In other words, it is a love it or hate it affair. Moving to the side, you get LED turn indicators on the side mirrors. GLX Plus and up variants get 16-inch two-tone alloy wheels in 205-55 R16 tires. You get ventilated disc brakes in front and drum brakes on the rear. Moving to the rear, the expander gets a more traditional looking rear end. It doesn't look as striking as the front. All variants get LED combination taillights. You also get a rear fog light on the center part of the bumper. Overall, the rear end of the expander is definitely stylish especially with those L-shaped LED taillights which look great at night. The exterior color of the expander is known as titanium gray metallic. Under the hood, all expanders are powered by a 1.5-liter 4A91 inline 4-cylinder Mivec gasoline engine. It has 105 horsepower and 141 Nm of torque. It is paired to a 4-speed automatic transmission. Power is sent to the front wheels. On the key of this expander GLX Plus, you can find your lock and unlock buttons. Now getting inside, the expander gets a black interior with fabric seats. This variant gets a 3-spoke polyurethane steering wheel. Here, you have the lever for your 4-speed automatic transmission with low gear selection and overdrive.
This variant is also equipped with a rear backup camera. All expanders are equipped with single zone manual climate control. The knob on the left controls your different modes. The one on the right controls your temperature. Below you have the buttons for your rear defrost, recirculation, and AC. This variant of the expander comes equipped with a 7-inch capacitive touchscreen display. The system features AM and FM radio, iPod connectivity, auxiliary, USB, Bluetooth, and navigation. The system is similar to the one on the Mitsubishi Strada. As with most touchscreen displays these days, the addition of a volume knob would be most appreciated. Here you have your USB. Here your navigation. The Navi system's graphics is clear enough but phone navigation would probably be our preference. Here you have your navigation menu where you can select a destination, find the Mitsubishi dealership, and see your navigation settings. Here you have your different system settings. Here you have your phone mirroring menu. You can select whether to connect your Android phone or your iPhone. Here you have your Bluetooth menu. On the sides of the screen, you have different shortcut touch sensitive buttons. Overall, the system may need some improvements when it comes to responsiveness. Below you have your USB port and auxiliary input. You also get a 12 volt power outlet. You also get some storage space. You have two cup holders in the center console, and more storage. The trip computer on the GLX Plus variant shows your mileage, odometer, fuel range, average fuel economy, and service interval. To the left, you can find your power mirror adjustments. On the right part of the steering wheel, you can find your cruise control, and on the left, your audio controls. Here you have your door and window locks. Here your window controls. The driver's side window is automatic up and down. You get storage on the passenger side above the glove box. Moving to the rear, the expander's second row gives you a generous amount of space. 
Anyone with a height of 5 feet and 6 inches won't have any problem here. You can also fit 3 small adults here with no issues. Here in the second row, you get seat pockets behind the driver's seat only. One is for your phone, one is for a tablet, and one can fit a laptop. You also get air vents on the ceiling. The center backrest becomes your armrest by pulling a strap. Folding the second row to access the third row isn't difficult. Getting into the third row isn't difficult as well. Legroom is also very good for someone with a height of 5 feet and 6 inches with the second row move forward. The seat rails do slightly eat into foot space. Two passengers would definitely fit comfortably here. Back here, you get a power outlet and some storage on the side. You also get a cup holder. Compared to some other vehicles, you still have lots of foot space here. Folding the second row to get out of the third row is likewise not difficult. Moving further back, the expander has a good amount of space in the trunk. Even with the third row up, you can still probably fit three small sized trolleys. Folding the third row down for more space more than doubles the cargo capacity. Folding the seats down is also extremely easy. The expander has a maximum cargo capacity of 1,630 liters with both second and third rows down. Putting the seats back up is also super easy. Underneath the floor, you have even more storage. So that's all for the 2019 Mitsubishi Expander GLX Plus. Please do subscribe if you haven't and watch out for more videos.